Hey, what is up everybody on YouTube? This is the Warrior of Youth, Orgas Chavez here, and welcome back to more Bloom's Monkey City Mobile. Anyways, not much has happened. I just did a couple of tiles right here. I got some heli pilots, and that's pretty much it, right? Yeah. Um, we're this close to city level 26, and as you can see, I've popped a lot of spice, and yeah, it's been pretty great. Been doing such very great, you know. So, contested territory action. Let's move on up. To get to round 56, you don't really need supply crates. I just use them to get done with the game faster. You don't really need them. My opponent's highest round will be 36. So, our goal is to beat round 36, and I'll just end the episode there. Alright, so. Oh, wait, no. Never start off with a farm. This is how you want to start it off. We start it off with the monkey engineer, and we'll get that upgrade. And then we'll just start off with a dart monkey. So that's pretty much how we want to start off today's episode. <clears throat> we gotta get this dart monkey to zero three, and that's pretty much what's gonna take help us win in this territory. So there we go, zero three. And we're going to just wait on to upgrade it. It's taking forever, but we'll see. Anyways, if you guys missed the previous episode of Contested Territory, it will be in the description. You know, the link will be in the description. Also, my Facebook, for those of you that want to add me, whether you're Android or iOS, I really don't care. If you want to add me for some crates, and go ahead. If you don't, then that's fine with me. I don't care, like I said. Anyways, um, oh yeah, my game center is always in the description. I don't know if you guys have noticed that. It's always important to check the description, you know, just in case you guys want to. And that's pretty much it. So, I don't know if you guys remember the last episode. Very great. We made a, a huge record. And I just made another record, you know, going to round 56. It's so amazing. But and it's the same thing. The only thing that's going to be different in this map, it's it's that it's not water, so we cannot use the first strike capability. And I don't think we can use monkey subs. No, we can't. So instead of using first strike capability, what you want to use is the sun gods and the ground zeros and a couple of balloon chippers just in case. That's all you need to be using, and that's gonna help you get up to round forty, round fifty. Wherever the heck you want to go. Now, let's just say, for example, your opponents are noob cakes, like Super John Bombo likes to say. Let's just say that they're all noobs. And let's say that their highest round is 36, because that's the highest round in my contested territory. So that's why I'm referring to 36. So let's say the highest round is 36. And you're like, okay, well, I want to be the owner of this contested territory. What do I have to do? Beat round 36. And that is where I come into play. I will show you how to beat round 36. Oh, yes, I will. Trust me. I'm using a couple spikes, you know, just to save some lives, or actually all of my lives. And we sell the dart monkey, boon trap, boom. Eh, I don't like camels. There we go. And then we're going to get the dart monkey right back. And we're going to upgrade it because we're going to have some more camel balloons very soon. So, did you guys see how fast I got the balloon... The balloon trap, it was actually pretty fast. Oh, no. Oh, stupid camos. There we go. There we go. So that's pretty much what you do. You got to be fast in micro. And for those of you guys that do not know what micro is, it is just the way you're supposed to defend any incoming balloon attack, whether it's in battles or in Bloons Monkey City or in BTD5. It's just the way you defend any attack, where you sell towers or buy upgrades, whatever it is that you do, that is what they call micro. Everyone should be familiar with that. But if you're not, then now you know. So, now we got the Dark Monkeys upgraded. Now we're just going to be farming. Yeah, that's pretty much what we need to do. We got to do some farming action. And I don't even think I need farming action. Oh, but anyways, back, back to the point I was trying to make. So... Let's just say that the highest round is 36. Do you really want to go all the way up to round 50, round 45, or something like that? No, there's no reason to waste your time. 
go ahead and do something else with your little extra minutes that you saved, right? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to end this episode at round 40. That's pretty much it. We're ending this at the end of 40. And yeah, all you're going to be seeing is a bunch of ground zeros and maybe some sun gods in action. That's pretty much all you're going to be seeing. It's, it's nothing new, guys. You know, so that is why I don't want to waste my time with the contested territory. And this is the last contested territory I will be doing. I've done them all, you know, snow tiles, uh, water tiles, volcanoes, you name it. I've done mostly all of the cool contested territories. I'm pretty much done, you know, and it's, you know, it's getting close to that time of the year where I have to study for finals and all that stuff. Yeah, definitely. So yeah, I kind of don't have time for school. I mean, I kind of don't have time for balloons. That's what I meant. Sorry about that. I'm half asleep. I'm sleepy. And it's only what? What time is it anyway? It's uh, 9.41. Holy crap. And I'm already talking like in half of sleep. Well, for me, it's late. Uh, usually, from now on, I've made a decision to switch my bedtime from freaking midnight all the way to 9 p.m. or 9.30 p.m. Today it's a Saturday night, I will be sleeping at 11 p.m. And tomorrow on Sunday, I will be sleeping at 9 p.m. or 9.15 or whatever, you know, I'll be in bed by 9. That's the big deal. Why am I doing this? Well, I told you guys I had a problem sleeping, but, well, yeah, it is a problem. But I caused the problem. It's It was my fault. I would be like, um, yeah, I ain't going to sleep. I'm going to be playing some Balloons Tower Defense Battles. Or I'm going to be playing some Balloons Monkey City. That's how I would be like. And then in the morning, I would, when I had to go to school, oh, crap, I don't, uh, I don't know what to do. Yeah, that's how I would feel. And not only that, the other reason why I decided, you know, to create an earlier bedtime, it's because I've been getting some anxiety attacks. Believe it or not, uh, if you deprive yourself from sleep, you're going to most likely get anxiety attacks. Now, that, that does not happen to everybody, uh, just me. It just happened. Anxiety attacks, and also because I didn't eat breakfast, too much caffeine. I told you guys I would always be getting a lot of energy drinks, like Monster. I quit that stuff, by the way. I don't drink energy drinks at all. It's been a long time since I've drank one. I would say at least four weeks. And I'm going to, you know, I'm going to keep that streak alive. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, crap. Ceramics, huh? No problem. Just need that bomb tower. It should be just fine. Yeah, there we go. And we'll get this apprentice upgraded. There we go. So now we're going to be saving up for the fourth tier farm. It's ready round 16. Cool. All right, so... 14k, right? 5k, 7, 9, 11k. Uh, 13k, so I need $3,000. And then, okay, there we go. We made it. So you told you guys, I can do the math. Math major here, if you guys didn't know that. Yep, I'm a math major in Cal State Los Angeles. Math is my thing. I can do math very fast. I can do big numbers. Of course, you know, I could add 101 plus 102 or whatever it is you want me to add. And the way I add big numbers, it's kind of crazy. I leave out all the, you know, let's say, for example, you have 102 and plus 101. I leave out the small numbers and I add the 100s first. And then I add the small numbers like the 2 and the 1. And that's it. That's all I do. That's how I do my math. I don't do the little stick thing. Oh, you got to carry the 1 and all that crap. No, I don't do that elementary math. In my head, there's no way I can do that. In my head, the only thing I have to do is add and subtract stuff. That's the only thing I know how to do. So there we go. That was fast, by the way. Moab. Be getting other balloon shipper soon. We need two of them for the Moabs. We just need two of them. I'm telling you guys, you're going to need two of them. So yeah, that is pretty much what we're going to do for this episode. We're just going to make it to round 40. Uh, most of the people that I've ran into, they're all kind of noobs. And I don't mean to be messed up, but they're kind of noobs. And they got to learn to get their crap together, you know? They, they got to learn how to play the game. If not, they're, they're going to be losing contested territory often, and they might as well not play. 
And that is exactly why I make these tutorials for you guys. That is exactly why I made this little mini series. But, you know, as it once said, you know, every good thing has to come to an end sometime. So, contested territory, I'm pretty much done with it. Like I said, I have, I have to focus on school. And I can't just be playing contested territory every day. You know, I don't really need all these bloomstones anyway. I already have all the cool upgrades. I just need to get some temples or something. You know, I gotta get the temple. And um, that's pretty much it, you know. Fourth tier apprentices. I I'm not really too worried about too worried about those. Holy crap. Did we lose a ton of crap loads of life? Yeah, we did. So, there we go. That should, that should help us out. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much what should help us out. There we go. We'll keep that like that. So there we go. We lost some lives. I mean, that's sad. I lost lives. I was looking forward to losing lives, but okay. That is what I need to do, and I will lose lives. There's just so many balloons on the screen. There's too many of them. Too many evil balloons on the freaking screen, guys. Too many of them. So we're going to get a, a third farm very soon. Where the heck can I fit? There we go. I only need three farms. I don't really need four farms or five. Nah, I'm just going to keep three of them because we're only going to round 40. If I were to go to like round 50 or something, yes, I would probably need all five of them. So it's it's your choice if you want to get all the farms. You don't really need to since you have the balloon trap. You're going to be getting a lot of money from it anyway. So you're pretty much all set. We'll get a little ninja down here. We'll get a ninja. Just to, you know, for extra popping power. We got a little ninja. Let's see how many pops. Wow, that's a lot of pops for a couple of seconds. Anyways, we got to finish up with the farm very soon. Bam, we got it. And you know what? Just for the sake of it, screw it. Let's go. Let's show you guys the five farms. What the hell? Let's let's do it. Why not? Let's do it. Might as well. Might as well. There we go. There. So what I like to do first, I like to get the farm... Most of the time, I like to get them like this. Bam. We, I like to get the 3-2 farm, and then I'll get the 4th tier farm. Because usually, I would I will forget to get the upgrade, you know, the valuable bananas. Sometimes, I'll forget to get that upgrade. And that's a very important upgrade for farms. Indeed, it is. So. There we go. Have it on pursuit. And now, we just need to upgrade the Apache dart ship. You know, the two fourth tier helic pilots. And then I'll be just fine. I'll be in the clear, right? Anyways, round 29. Not bad. It's almost 10 p.m. By the time you're seeing this video, it's probably Sunday. Today's Saturday, but let's just say it's Sunday today. Yay. All right, so there we go. Oh, yeah, one more thing. Many of you guys have been wondering... The streak, is it still alive? Yes, I haven't really played at all. It's still 50 and 0. But by the time we have another Battles episode, it's going to change. Actually, not really. I take that back. Uh, I'm going to do one more subscriber and, tri and, and uh, warrior battles. And then we'll see. I'm going to do one more. And that's pretty much it. Because I have to do school stuff. If not, I would do as many subscriber and warrior battles. But right now, I just kind of don't have the time for it. It's okay though guys, you know, I'll have the time. I'll make the time. At least right now. It's time for finals. So I gotta study very hard for those. Alright, so we're gonna get this thing upgraded very soon. There we go. Wow, a bunch of dart chip and the bloom chippers. Seem to be doing a great job. So we just need to get this oh there we go. Now we need to get it up to 4th tier, and I'm done. That's pretty much how you get the 5 farms, guys. I bought you a dart chip and a couple bloom chippers, and you should be just fine. Because the heli pilots are overpowered. Yes, they are. They indeed are very, very overpowered. There we go, and um, we'll be getting Ring of Fire. Ring of Fires. Ring of Fire right there. And a stupid Ring of Fire. There we go. And a Ring of Fire right there. There we go. Ring of Fires. So now we'll get the Super Monkey. Actually, no, I don't want it there. I want it right there. Strong. 
upgrade it. <laughs> upgrade Super Monkey again. I keep forgetting to tap the, the Bloom Trap. I get so much money from it. I forgot to tap it. There we go. Round 33. It's not so hard, right? I mean, just look at all this money that we have. Definitely. We're going to make it, guys. Don't worry. If we weren't going to make it, I wouldn't be doing this video. But I know I'm going to make it. So, we'll get another Bloom Chipper up here. It's our third Bloom Chipper. Or third, fourth, two Bloom Chipper. And then we'll get another Sun God while we're at it. Yeah, we're probably going to go for another Sun God. I just like Super Monkeys. They're so cool. Alright, they got destroyed. Then again, I could... No, I don't want Glue Gunner. Actually, it's not a bad idea to get a Glue Gunner. Why not? Glue Gunner and a Bomb Tower. Or a Cannon. Oh, it doesn't fit anymore. Dang it, stupid Glue Gunner. Took my spot, man. I'll get him right there. Yeah, we'll get the glue hose. There we go. The bomb tower. Super monkey fan club. We only have three three dart monkeys. We're about to get more though. Four four dart monkeys. Can I fit any more? No, I can't fit any more up there. Slowly trying to fit the dart. There we go. Five dart monkeys. Six dart monkeys. Seven. Eight. Nine. And a ten. Look at the tenth one. Right here. There we go. So we're pretty much all set now. We'll just continue. So we're about to beat round 36. This is the round where a lot of the people in my contested territory have trouble with. I have no idea what's so hard about round 36. Maybe they, ju they just don't have ground zero and the sun god. Maybe that's the problem. Or maybe they did not farm well enough. That could be another problem. So we don't know, guys. We don't know what could have gone wrong. We're going to stop at round 40. Remember that. So all we have to do... What we didn't do in the last episode is just use more ground zero. Just use the freaking ground zero. And we'll get the other one. Oh, crap. Wrong upgrade. Boom. See, ground zero and it takes them down easily. And eventually you're going to be... One more thing to keep in mind. You're going to have to be using ninjas for this one. That's something we couldn't do in the previous one. So what you want to do is use some ninjas. All right. So I'll show you what I mean. You get a couple ninjas, you're probably going to need at least two. And you're going to want to slow down the ZOMGs if you go to late game, to like round 40 or something. You're going to want to get that ninja. Oh, crap, I accidentally tapped it. And if you want to get a spike storm or something. And then I'll just build the rest of the sun gods because I pretty much have nothing else to build and I'm bored. So let's build some sun gods. There we go. Sun god and the sun god right here. That's it. That's There you go. The three sun gods and the ground zero. That's all you want to be doing to get up into round 50 or and above. Just make sure you slow down the balloons with the sabotage supply lines. I'll show you how it works. As you can see, we're going to slow down the balloons right now. Look. See? It doesn't look like they slow down, but yeah, they do slow down by half speed. So, just keep your keep your keep that in mind. I would always get at least two or three Super Monkey fan clubs, but since I sold everything, I don't need them anymore. And we'll just ground zero that stuff. There we go, see? You see how fast the ground zero takes them down? Sabotage supply line. Spike storm. And this will be the end of the episode right here. At the end of round 40, we'll just call it day. Because I really don't need to go above round 40 for my contested territory. But like I said, if you, do, if you still want to go up there... Then what you should have done, do not sell the farms. Make sure you still have them. And sell them only when you feel that you're going to die so you don't die. That's all you have to do. I would go late game, but that's just too much time. And I kind of want to go to bed already. So I might as well just, you know, go to bed, guys. So this will be the end of contested territory. 
There we go. We made it to round 41. Let's just go ahead and let the balloons kill us. Um, come on, sun gods. Bye-bye, sun gods. I'm going to miss you. I'm going to miss you, sun gods. Let's see how the Super Monkey fan club does with those uh, ZOMGs. Seems to be doing good. I don't even know where the ground... Oh, there it is. Get some ground zero action in there, but <laughs> that's a lot of ZOMGs. Boom. Damn. Come on, ZOMGs. Boom. Oh, well, I wanted to pop them to be a base, but it didn't happen. So that is pretty much it. So that's how you go to round 40 and above. Like I said, I could have gone high up, but I'll just leave the video down in the description for you guys so you see how you get to late game in case you missed the last episode. But other than that, that is pretty much it for today. I mean, just look at this. Look at this. Zero. 36. 33. 29. 20. And what kind of disappoints me, this guy, city level 27, he should have a tempo right now. He should probably be at around round 60 or something, you know, claim round 60. And that's exactly another reason why I don't want to play contested territory after city level 26. It's just going to get too much time consuming uh, everyone's going to be fighting for a spot, you know, all the pro players are going to be going all the way to round 60 or something, and I just, you know, like I said, I'm, I don't want to waste my time on that. I already have way too many Bloomstones. How did I get too many Bloomstones? Well, I started with 500, so, yeah, you know, and you could always watch an ad, or you could visit your friend's cities or something, and there we go. So, we're about to make city level 26, and there we go, city level 26, we now have new buildings, of course. We get four boon stones, 700 cash. We now start with 2,850 cash and 145 lives. Cool. Looking forward to playing at city level 26. I will be playing other stuff, like maybe Monkey v. Monkey or something. We'll see. So, this is the Warrior of Youth saying, make sure you have a great day. Enjoy your Sunday. Enjoy whatever is left of your weekend. Have fun and uh, peace.